Hello and Happy New Year. I am Sally Bingham and I want to thank you for being part of the Interfaith Power and Light campaign and for all that you do to make it a success. We're going to build in 2010 on the success of Copenhagen. While not everything we wanted to have happen happened there, there were some good, good things and two of them were the fact that China and India are now involved and also that hundreds of millions of dollars have been pledged to protect the most vulnerable countries around the world against climate devastation. We are now being watched by the rest of the world. Will the United States Senate pass climate legislation? We believe here at IPL that it is a moral obligation of the United States to pass legislation and we know that we're being watched and we know that we have to do it. So the Interfaith Power and Light campaign has a super important role this year to get that religious voice and the moral obligation that we have into the minds of the senators who will be voting this year on climate legislation. I invite you on the weekend of February 14th to be participating in a campaign that we are organizing. It's a preach-in and it's focusing on love. Valentine's Day is a perfect time for us to answer the call that God gave us to love our neighbors as ourselves. We also can focus on love of the planet. So if you can organize a educational event in your parish, if you can invite your clergy to be speaking about climate change from the pulpit, we think it's going to have a tremendous influence on getting the religious message out about climate change and how important it is. Let's make 2010 the year for climate legislation. And thank you again for all of your help. Go to interfaithpowerandlight.org slash preach in and register if you're going to get involved in this campaign, which I know you will, and I am certainly praying that you will, and that this will be the time that we make climate legislation happen and the United States becomes a leader in protecting creation, the creation that we all love and that God loves. Once again, Happy New Year and thank you for your help.